Hi, this is Tammy, and I'm calling in support of, you know, Will Taylor, Strings Attached. I went one summer to a couple of his shows, and I didn't know what to expect. And one time I went by myself, and the other time I took a friend of mine. And I was in for one of the times of my life, and I have had a really exciting life, so that's something to be said. I went there, and I expected some small little shows, something. There were hundreds of cars parked outside. There were people everywhere, and um, some of them were, you know, selling a lot of stuff that they had made. Everyone was funny and friendly, and the music, Will Taylor and his band, and he had some other people fly in, um, very well-known people, wonderful artists, musicians from all over, under the stars, and it was incredible. It was literally a, just one of my... One of many cherished memories that I have. So if Will Taylor and Strings were to disappear after 18 years of this, because Austin is changing or, you know, it's getting bigger. I come from Chicago. Austin is big. It ain't that big, okay? So for me to be able to go do something like this and you hear these amazing musicians right up front and close, which I could never do in Chicago, ever, then Will Strings, you know, Will Taylor and Strings Attached, we would be losing something, a huge something in Austin because he has everyone come and work with him and his own bands and, you know, his own musical abilities are phenomenal. So I just want to put that out there, and it's very close to my heart. It's very personal when you go to his shows, and it's a wonderful time. Again, I don't want to lose Will um, Taylor's strings attached, after not after 18 years. And not just because Austin's getting bigger and, you know, crowded with more people. That's not a good enough reason for me. So there you go. Thank you very much. Have a good day.